Roby. Roby. Who the fuck is Roby? I don't know. Jack Marshax. And where the fuck is Jason? There's a monkey. Oh, I get it. His hockey mask is going to be here, right? Sip, boo, boo, sip. Friday the 13th. I think it's awesome how they gave Jason his own show. Right. That's so cool. Oh, he's getting his mother's inheritance finally. <laughs> he's going to get the sweater. Yeah. He's mm. getting the sweater. Nice little fucking subplot there. I think you got to get a spin off of the movie. Because it turned out his mom was a stockholder in Camp Crystal Lake. She was married to Martin Sheen on Wall Street. Who knew? So it's an antique shop full of Jason stuff. Right? I don't see Jason stuff. You give it a chance. You gotta put the Jason shit in the back. Shrunken head. That was a shitty ending to a book. I don't think he understands how customers work. <laughs> this job be great, but for all the goddamn customers. <laughs> <laughs> That's how it happens too, no matter where you go though. Like right at closing, people come in and want to browse. She break you by. <laughs> she make an eye contact with the bed, she fucks with this stuff. Almost said that. Sick burn. I almost said that. Yes. Because she's right. Let her look around a bit. She'll be good. Won't you, honey? No. The what? Well, maybe you should stay with her. Just saying. babies. Uh-oh. I sense danger. Well, that doesn't have anything to do with Jason. I was about uh, to say, where's the fucking Jason masks? I'm starting to or think... What's going on? Jason might not be in this show. But that would be a dumb name for a show. Totally. I mean, if Jason ain't in it... Then why is it called Friday the 13th? The series. Why do they call it fucking creepy antique shop? Dun dun dun. Like needful things. Run, little bitch. Or a thieving little bitch. What the fuck? That'd be kind of creepy. Just chilling, working on your car, and some little fucking girl comes running with a doll baby. <laughs> Kill. Kill. Where's your parents? Kill her. There's no place for a little girl like you. You better leave us alone. You have a smart little bus, too. 
So it was a little girl related to the Voorhees family? What the fuck? Did Jason do like the Chucky curse thing and get himself trapped in a fucking doll? We Dembala. Give me the power, I beg of you. Went out walking in the rain. They seem like bad parents. They really weren't paying attention to her at all. She's got quite an imagination. She made a doll. How much is the doll? I'd be glad to pay you for it. She's not for sale. Nothing's for sale in here. Then why do you have a store? <laughs> hey, what's he doing inventory on? You're not selling nothing. <laughs> right, everything should be the same. <laughs> Shit just wanders off. Zero times zero is zero. <laughs> Damn jacket. <laughs> I gotta bag this bitch up. What they didn't know was he was really in there robbing the place. <laughs> oh, that'd be funny. <laughs> <laughs> the real owner's upstairs dead. Jason. Is he hiding from Jason? Is Jason down there? <laughs> but if all the items are cursed, then what good does that do? I don't know, man. Still trying to figure out where the fuck Jason is. Oh, shit. Well, that can't be good. <laughs> but then why is he there? Like, I could see if he was like, 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 uh, like a demon or something selling all this freaky shit to people but he doesn't want to be there apparently no, I, don't, that, I gave up what the fuck the effect on the steps wasn't bad so, damn, this I was I was trying to get out of here before inventory <laughs> that's prune face he's a vampire And you thought you had a bad night at work. What the fuck? When did that come from? It wasn't that bad a minute ago. Oh, shit. That looks amazing. <laughs> and now back to Perfect Strangers. Right? Well, you certainly picked a fine time to go away. Darling, let's not start that again. This company picnic means a lot to me. Bitch, bitch, bitch. Top partners from the firm will be there. I think I can time. I'm only going for a couple of days. Well, that's good. Because I was planning on announcing our engagement then. And it would behoove you to be present. She go go out and leave to do some of that fucking... I love it. Every time you get dismissed, you act like I'm opposing counsel. Snitch. I'm sorry. Gotta go swill my royal oats. I just wish you'd get this darn antique store <laughs> business over with. Boy, you know I want to get it over with as quickly as you. I don't know why this Uncle Lewis left me the store. I hadn't even met him, let alone his cousin, who I'm supposed to be sharing everything with. Uncle Lewis? Okay. Oh, fuck. Maybe I can sue your cousin for a greater percentage of the inheritance. I can get in some litigation experience. It's like, I don't think we should get married. You're already trying to fuck over my family. It's just happened. Uh -huh. <laughs> News at 10. Like, even in passing, even as a joke. Right. Why did you say that? Yeah, already. Like, that was quick. That was the most awkward kiss I've ever seen in my life.
Did he shut his door? Ah, never mind. <laughs> I didn't even notice. I've watched enough dumb shit today. Sorry, we're closed. I think I'd be open. He's fucking dead. Huh? Yep. She gets raped by that guy in the background. Where is this door? Where was she going? What city are we in? Anybody here? Did it say? I don't think it said. Okay, fine. Even if it was in your family, it's basically hell on earth. Why would you stay there? Well, they don't know this. She didn't even met like, this guy before. I mean, they, like, the, like, the prune face had to have found out at some point. And he up there doing inventory. For, for a store that doesn't sell anything. <laughs> <laughs> Why are there candles lit? Nobody's in there. Oh, Jesus. <laughs> that was an antique, bitch. That must be Roby. Don't tell me you're Ryan Dalion. Yeah, that's me. Why did she say it like that? Ryan the Lion. How'd you know? Uncle Melissa's lawyer told me you'd be here. I'm your cousin, Nikki. How do you do? Uh, Michelle Foster? <laughs> Michelle? Jeez. I, I, I thought the telegram said Michael Foster. I was, the fuck is I a telegram? <laughs> so, sure does change things. Not really. Why are you covering like yourself up if that's your cousin? He shouldn't be having any fucking pure <laughs> yeah. thoughts anyway. <laughs> Maybe we were in West Virginia. Uh. Where are you going? To call my fiance to let him know I arrived safely. Is that all right with you? Sorry with me, sure. Hope you can yell real loud. But if there's a no electricity, I'm going to bet you that the phones fucking don't work. Kimbo. Who is that? He seems familiar. I've had a little turbulence all day. Hey, hey. I don't know. Wow. That's a great idea. Maybe you should lock yourself in there. Kind of a man would be interested in stuff like this. Not a kind of guy, huh? Why do you think he left this place to us? <coughs> the lawyer said it was in probate. We won by default. Lucky us. What? <laughs> they, they shouldn't have made them cousins. <coughs> this is bad. I feel like that was an easy fix. That's pretty sweet. I needed a car. Fuck yeah. yeah. You got a car out of it. We'll make out later. <laughs> yeah, why do you want to put it in the back seat? I'm just trying to figure this out because we're not in a garage. How to get this bitch in here? You know what that means? Almost certain death. Great joke. Mickey, it was just a cat. Look, I don't care. Let's get down to business. Oh, Jesus. I think we should first get an appraisal of this property. Well, I'll tell you this. The inventory books are the easiest you'll ever do in your life. Don't 
They all say zero. It's like he never sold anything. All the numbers are the same. What is this place? <clears throat> yeah. Great strength of feet. <laughs> well, we're gonna get locked in this bitch. Scrooge McDuck style. <laughs> Was Ryan in part nine? What was that? I'll check it out. Who's Ryan? The, the cousin here. Roby? Oh, yeah. well. The dude, uh -oh. the dude with the glasses? Wah, wah. But I'm pretty sure this show came out before we got the nine. Mm hmm. It was way before. Yeah, I'll wait. This shit probably came out around three, Manhattan, right? Four or five, yeah. Yeah. Four or five years before. Stand still. You dumb fuck. She got the doors open. <laughs> the fuck? It's booby trapped. Didn't you see the boobies? It's a death man. I'll be twisting all them fucking things and see what else pops out. <laughs> At some point, a giant boulder is going to chase us. <laughs> Candles everywhere in this place. Did this kid light them all? There's no way. Look at him. <laughs> I don't smoke. Pussy. It's like the third thing she's broke. She smashed a fucking vase over his head when he first got there. <laughs> I don't want to run this store with you. Ryan, this might come as a great shock to you, but I don't want the store. I came here to sell everything off. Sell it? This has been given to us as a sacred trust. Passed down from generation to generation. Oh, that's a crap, Ryan. We didn't even know Uncle Lewis. Thank God for that. Okay. Ryan. You can have the I IMDB. Red Hot. So hot sauce? What the fuck's this guy doing out here? I will gladly pay you Tuesday for a hamburger today. <laughs> I think he had lighter hair and glasses. <laughs> right as the customers walk by. <laughs> Fuck, I hate this place. <laughs> Playing hockey at one. Excuse me. I was here about oh, six man. months ago. You had an antique doll. Its mouth moved like a puppet. Yeah. What? Yeah. Oh, yeah. I know just the one you're talking about, sir. 1987 to 90. Just sell him the fucking doll. 
45 minutes show my ass. If they just sell them the doll, that would be it. <laughs> if I walk, the movie will be over. The fuck is a check? Hey, that was him and I. Uh... By tomorrow, we should have just about everything sold. Just in time for you to go to that picnic with Baron Mason. Sure was. Is that how they connect the show to the movie? She cast the same fucking doofus. That's the worst fucking tie-in ever. That wouldn't even make any sense though, because it's from 87 to 90. Was this? Jason goes to hell ain't come out to win like 93, I think. Something like yeah, that. Yeah, so I don't, I don't think. It's just fucking some kind of random quinky dink. <laughs> Well, I don't like queen yeah. things. I just think he auditioned for the part. Right. Hollywood, they don't give a fuck. And then they got this fucking asshole. Rules not apply. Who's in here stealing my stuff? Drop it! <laughs> Who the fuck are you? Who are you? <laughs> Who are we? Who are you? I'm Uncle Lewis. Jack Marshak. I supply this store with antiques. You've got a funny way of delivery. This isn't a delivery. It's more of a pickup. Louis Vendredi always had a selected memory about paying my invoices. But about you? You know Uncle Lewis? Uncle Lewis. That's right, he was our uncle. I think we should hire a new delivery guy. We're not from around here. <laughs> Fucking monkeys got him, didn't they? Oh, God. The evil God. monkey and the doll. We're going to spend ten more minutes on fucking Uncle Lewis. Maybe we shouldn't pick the uh, pilot episode. Lewis was always deathly afraid of growing old, and he was passionate about wealth. And those two things ruled him until he dabbled in things that I wanted no part of. Like what? Hookers in Thailand. He belongs to Thailand now. Good. How did you know that? It's the monkey's paw. Three wishes. And you can't do that shit while you wish for a thousand more wishes. No. Three wishes. I'm sorry. Hey, we got to figure out if maybe they got the Voorhees dagger in this little shop. Ah. Oh. Then maybe his tie to the movies would be he's the Voorhees Dagger Protector instead of Luke, Duke, whatever the fuck. Guess what? Guess what? I'm sure they're not as smart as me to tie that in like that. Mm. There's no way. Here, hold this. And don't read it. They're very trusting. <laughs> what is it? What's wrong? <laughs> he opened that fucking door like he knew what was going on. He's like, ah, what's this? <laughs> Did you expect something to be in here? Uh-huh. Mm -hmm. What date? Mm -hmm. Um, May 29th. On May the 30th, the man was struck by lightning, putting up a metal weather vane. <laughs> <laughs> and that's when he made time travel possible. <laughs> 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 so 
66 times. That was heavy. I thought this was about a doll. I thought this was about Jason. You don't break a pact with the devil. Why? Oh, what happened? Believe Of course, he had to fuck it ass. He wins both ways. In this case, Lewis lost his life. And the antiques remain cursed. What about the antiques we sold? Those two, I should think. Well, we just Oops. killed people. What dog? The one that the, was moving the down the The one fucking item we sold? What are you talking about? You sold... Dun, dun, dun. Oh, wow. What's that little Mary bitch? Had a Bruno and the boys get the get the doll from the fucking crazy guy. Can we still talk? I can still do everything, Mary. And more. People to push her down the steps. Friends till the end, remember? This is the end, friend. She just put that bag in the hamper, or is that a trash container? It looks like something a King Cobra comes out of. Right. How do you expect a child to appreciate anything when she doesn't earn it? It would break her heart if I take that doll away from her now. Let me handle it. Huh. I'm gonna kill the bitch. Invoice, invoice, invoice. <laughs> <laughs> but how is it under the other ones in the between all Good the other job. ones? There's a card reader I know. A medium. Maybe able to shed some light. Mary Ann. You do know that it's not too late to go home and forget all of this ever happened. Sweet. Peace. Bye. You got this amount. I'm not about this cursed thing, but if there's the slightest chance that you're right. But that little doll being possessed. I could murder that little girl and the whole family. Sucks to be them. Let's get the pizza. Are you having fun? No. Huh? Are you? Lots. You know, I'm having fun. I thought she was going to say she's a bitch. I hate her. Oh, I see. She doesn't let you buy as many toys as your daddy, does she? No. She didn't even want me to have you. I think that maybe she should be punished, don't you? Okay, who wants some more cake? Nobody can have any if they... She didn't say no. She's going to say, I don't like you neither. All right. <laughs> then I'll clean up my room. I'm sorry. It's too late for that. Now, you left your bicycle down on that driveway again after you promised me not to. I'm going to have to take away your new door. No, yes. Now, you can have her back in a week after you've had some time to think about keeping your promises, Mary. Oh, no. shit. You'll never take her away. 
Run away! She's going over the banister. You get in your room, young lady, and you stay there! Alright. You still say over the banister? I don't know, man. It's... I'll stick with steps. It's something like that, though. Cruising for a bruising, Missy. Give me that door. No. Mary I say we let him let him go. Oh. What the fuck? Disaster roller skates. She's going down the steps. You called it. It should have been a banana peel. Well, well it, it's it's in an odd I don't know. She might be going over the banister. Uh, nope. Oh, steps. Wah, wah. I'll do the fucking elbow drop from the top rope. Uh. Is she lit? But that's not the coroner. Excuse me. Do you know what happened? She fell down the stairs. How did they know that? It's awful. Such a nice family. There she is. Did With she the... die? I don't think she died. I don't think she died either. Don't be afraid. I'm your friend. We just want to talk to you for a minute. You're not a friend. Go away. Peace off. <laughs> You'll finish the job. Well, damn, you came all this way. You might as well go to the hospital. There you go. <laughs> Why? Where's Mary? She's right there. You mix the zannies and the Chardonnay again. Let me call the doctor. Ha! Box of wine. Puts me right out. Killer mommy. That's what I was just. They just keep stealing little lines from the fucking. the Jason stuff. You dirty cocksuckers! Fuck you! Fuck your face. I'm in charge now. <laughs> Sleep. Sleep. <laughs> You're gonna bite her fucking face off. Give me your nose. I swallow your soul. Swallow her soul? I think she did. I spot your soul. Oh my god. How do you know she's dead? She flatlined. And where the fuck is the staff? Yeah, nobody's coming in to check on her. Oh Mary Mary's fucking laughing. Mary, Mary, why are you bugging? <laughs> oh, she died. Yes, we are. We're Mrs. Sims, niece and nephew. Something wrong? 
<laughs> it used to be that easy then. No oh, doubt. Yeah. She had a cardiac arrest. We think. I'm very sorry. Goddamn doll. With the bite marks on her face. We haven't figured that out yet. Brian, I'm getting really scared. You have to tell Jack. We can't. He's off looking at his crystal ball or something, remember? Well, what are we going what? to do? Somebody could be in the same boat as Mrs. Sims right now. I think we should just get the fuck out of here. Go on home. You never did pick up her bike. Go on home. Thank you for coming over on such short notice. I I'm your mother, John. Why wouldn't I? I tend to drop shit when there's a death in the family. What's your neighbor? It's not me I'm worried about. Poor Mary. I'll What's move for two. It's this bike. She's lost two mothers now. <laughs> You'll go on. I'll take good care of her. Like, take care of her? Take care of her? Take care of her? Let's whack this bitch. This is Herbert. Now, beat it. Say hello to Herbert. Fuck Herbert. Okay, there's Chipper. Peter, I want to show you Chipper. Okay. Say hello, Chipper. And that's Chipper's mommy. And that was my... She could get stabbed with a fucking crochet, crochet like needle. Nothing ever happened. What the fuck is that thing? He's so much fun. Record player. Just like you said I was. What the fuck is that? She could get stabbed in the eye with a crochet needle. Chucky style. <laughs> Did you, you don't know how the, the fucking chain of command around here, bitch. I want some cool switch. Hit the switch! Give me the... Oh, Jesus. <laughs> Mary been smoking that shit again. Snatching cookies out my hand. <laughs> Calm down, Mary. You know what to do, Mary. <coughs> Get out. Yeah, that's your cue to leave. <clears throat> no, it's not. It's really not. Quit throwing seven inches at me. Oh, the fucking giraffe's gonna eat her. This is when the all sales final at your own risk kind of shit comes into play. Oh. Murray. Bust out my Swiss Army knife. Get in this door. This little bitch like, I'm just gonna leave. Fuck it. Whatever. Check over there. Put everything back. Clean my room, bitch. That's kind of awesome. I got pelted with these circular disc fucking things. I think they're called records. Strange. What's the number for 911? Yes, we need an ambulance. Uh, 33 Nottingham Way. Yes, I need a new fucking agent. I see her. Look, there she is. Wait. Hey, little girl, would you like some candy? This is for you, Damien. <laughs> nice. Do you remember me? I was at your house last night. I fucked your dad. You know why I'm here, don't you? I'm your new mommy. Vito. Vito. 
Dorito. Dorito? Dorito. Dorito. Danny Dorito? Dorito? You're gonna Vito Loco? <laughs> gotta attack my swings. It reminds me of my bad childhood because I never knew how they worked. I'm go up here and sit. Sweet. Clown head breathing fire. I need to learn that trick. <laughs> <laughs> he bopped her in the head. Got killed by a tether ball. I think the voice of reason went out the window after step bomb went down the steps. Just saying. I'm confused as to why she can't catch a little fucking girl. Give me the power, I beg of you. Thank you, I was thinking of not doing that. <laughs> Fucking punch her in the face. <laughs> Damn. Child abuse wasn't a thing back then. Oh, Jesus. She go. just fling the kid off the fucking merry-go-round? Oh, that was a little excessive. She's fucking dead, stuck over there in a fucking... Well, I don't know. I'd maybe not sell anything to anybody ever again. By the way, your other mom's dead if you don't remember. Suck the life right out of her. That's why he is out. Let's put that mystery in the books. <laughs> I mean, you could say uh, no refunds, then take the so shit back every time. Yeah. What do you think's gonna happen to Mary? Oh, good shrink ought to be able to fix her up in 20 years. It's, it's not your fucking problem. She's still fucked up. Boy, honey, we'll have to put the caterers on hold. Caterers? Yeah, it's got to do with the wedding. Oh, that's right, I forgot. I forgot all about that. I don't know how long. Uncle oh, Lord yeah. She's state. supposed to get married, huh? Lloyd, darling, you don't understand. I have no choice. I... Lloyd? <laughs> Wrong answer, bitch. Lloyd. It seems we're officially in business. Like, well, I guess I got a job. Click. <laughs> Maybe we should change the name of our place. What do you think? Yeah, it has nothing to fucking do with Jason. <laughs> We'll call it Everything Voorhees Antiques. Every pin, every tie tag, every stick of furniture. But if you keep selling shit, you're going to keep putting yourself through the same fucking bullshit you just did. Duke Washington. What? Where do we begin? Oh my god. There's a sale at Arby's. What did he see? What could it have been? I don't know, man. Here's it in the newspaper. I don't feel so good. He's like, this fucking show has nothing to do with Jason. Mm -hmm. Oh my god. He just read the script for the first time. It's like, Jason's not even in this fucking thing. That's oh my why you god. don't do it in that order. This is terrible. Let's never watch this again. <laughs> <laughs> Come on, you